everyone and welcome to another Ants Bennett video. So you may wonder why do we have Colony 2 today instead of the Dark Vaders? Well, Colony number 2 happens to be escaping from like somewhere in the tape. So let's uh, let me show you exactly how to deal with ants that escape in your ant room. First, you want to get ants with a brush or a cotton ball. I mean, either one works. Usually I use a brush and then put them into the portal like that. Hold on, guys. Yeah, that ant did not want to get off, which is cool because ants, they have like moist pads, so they will just like grip onto the brush and you kind of have to get them off. So yeah, that was a tricky part. Another ant over here. The ants over here. Also, you may want to check behind any kind of like furniture and bins and things like that like we have here because sometimes they will like hide either under like one of these for example or like in them so let's move this out all right guys so now that that's done the next step is to check where they have been escaping so for example this tape would honestly be a great indicator to like like little holes and stuff that they can like get out of through little crevices and we can probably see that over here and like somewhere under there you can probably see it so if that is not fixable which is what i'm going to show you today then let's move them into a new setup all right so what we have here is a ac ant tower or also called the ants canada ant tower small so this is what it comes with. It comes with the ant tower uh, AC test tube that has unfortunately been a little scratched. And then there is a vinyl tubing if you would like want to connect them to any other setups. Without further ado, let's open this. They also come with some connectors here. Like this AC connector. This is for like small ants. Like for example, my Tetramorium. There's also two AC stoppers, like these little plugs that you could just plug like right into there, see? So uh, without any further ado, let's build the ant tower and get our setup ready. Okay, so I can see why the sand is leaking. It's because the bag was flipped and the bag was open. So when you get your AC ant tower, don't, uh, don't expect the sand to just be perfect, although there is like some sand in there. Alrighty. Whoop! Next step, you're gonna wanna dampen it down so that the ants can nest in it and the and the and the moisture just seeps right through and it goes to like the lower parts of the nest. Let me show you what I so here as you can see the moisture is dripping down, which is good because the lower part of the nest has to be more damp and the higher part has to be more dry. So we're going to wait for all of this to dry and in the meantime we're just going to decorate this. So here we got our Ants Canada biome kit, like a little one. So we're going to be using some of the moss as the, the um, holder for moisture and yeah we can use some of the rocks and see what we can put. Alright, now that we decorated all the sand and and the decor and everything it's time to get some of this out of the plugs otherwise the plugs will not go through and it will be a problem and it will scratch them up so we always want to make sure we get some of that sand out of the plugs right here where the where the connectors and stuff is gonna go all right and you're gonna want to do this with a brush and just kind of go like this and scoop up some of that sand by the portal over here. Like that. And now we're good because the plug can go right through enough that the ants can't push it out and actually escape. And we can use the other one to connect the ants. All right, so we're in the ant room, but there's one more step. You've got to hydrate the hydration tub so that the ants have enough water. And there we go, it's time to move them in. All right guys, this is the moment of truth. 
There's going to be some escapees when I do this. So I have a cotton ball, just to get all of them up. Let's do this. Three, two, one. Here come. Oh no. All right, so I got them all into AC Ant Tower. Now we gotta scoop all of them. All right guys, they are all running around, so let's get them all with the cotton ball. Get them back in. And I'll see you guys after I get all these ants. Now we're going to use the other port for the drinking test tube. Alright guys, so I hope you enjoyed this video. As you can see, the ants love their new AC ant tower. And we hope that they dig into the sand eventually when they feel like they've run out of space. And yeah, please remember to subscribe, like, hit the notification bell. And if you have any questions, comment down below, and I will answer them as soon as I can. Enjoy the ants among us, and I'll see you in my next episode. Say bye to colony number two.